live Vitaly, as I am the real Vitaly. All you other Vitalys are just imitators, so walk the real Vitaly. Please stand up. Please, no, shut up, man. Why? You think you're the... Yes, I do. Well, you just pull it. No, you're the one that is full of No, I don't think you understand that. You... All right, here we are, episode three of the narrated slideshow of the 2014 Full Service Circus. Here we are in the backyard. This is the uh, first show. Um, Jackie Benson is on the stage opening for us. And there's Sean in the foreground wearing his sweet new circus hat that John McGuire made us this year. He seems to make one every year. That's awesome. Thank you, John. Uh, there's another shot of uh, Jackie right there. She's a beautiful singer, beautiful human being. And um, here's another angle. And uh, I just love the colors in this one. It's a beautifully colored photograph. Whoever took this photo, kudos. Here's Bonesaw. I'm assuming right after uh, Jackie wrapped up, he's making some type of announcement saying something like, All right, y'all, we have uh, Rudy's Barbecue and White Hat Rum to my left over there with Mom Saw and uh, my friend Schnook. And uh, here is that photograph with Mom Saw setting up the barbecue and Matt Schnook getting ready with the uh, servings of rum. Speaking of White Hat Rum, there is the man behind the rum. His name is Mike Jackal. And uh, he owns and he created White Hat Rum. Thank you so much for your involvement in the circus, Mike. Um, and there you are in the cut, enjoying your Saturday afternoon. Uh, I'd like to take a moment to thank our friend Jared for taking a lot of photos and video and uh, just being around that whole weekend. Thanks, Jared. Here he is lining up a sweet shot. All right, and then we took the stage Saturday afternoon. This was the first of our afternoon acoustic shows. And uh, it's pretty cool playing in front of four cartoon faces of yourselves and it's pretty cool being able to see the actual human faces and then in the background the cartoon faces I don't know if it was cool for you guys but it's cool for me to see right here right now um, another angle of our set I love this one a lot of people back there in the backyard no wonder we needed to make an emergency exit uh, let's roam around here see if we can uh, identify some people actually let's just zoom in to John Adams is John is John taking a nap wake up John come on bud Oh wait, wait, false alarm you guys, he's on his phone, he's probably posting something on the internet about how awesome this show is, and uh, man, John, that really backfired, and I apologize, moving on, oh, yet another angle, I like this one because, where's the previous photo, go back to the previous photo, yeah, this one's great color, I'm, I'm all about the color on this slideshow, this is sort of a cold tone, in terms of the color, and then let's go back to that, there we go, this is a warm tone, and I like both, there's room for both cold and warm tones in the world of photography. Fascinating. What am I talking about? Back to the slideshow. Um, and look, there's me. Uh, but let's not focus on me. Let's focus on my sweet, newly painted, purple, green polka dot conga drum. I was really proud of that. That was like a last minute thing. I did that, I think, on the Thursday before the circus. Uh, here's Bonesaw and some new kicks he got from Colleen's brother, Tim Schmidt. And uh, you might say he's pumped about the set we're playing right now. Get it? Pumps. Those are the name of the shoes. Uh, anyway, there's Smell. He still has his soccer captain armband on from earlier that day when Blue Team won the soccer match. Uh, and here he's executing a melodica part, like a boss. Uh, here's Bonesaw, looking like an Abercrombie model. Those eyes. That beard. Those curls. Good looking dude, Bonesaw. And there's me, looking like a doofus. Just doofusing it up. And uh, there I am kicking some sweet beats whilst singing. See, Mom, I can multitask. Uh, there I am again, finding something funny. Uh, there's always a lot of funny stuff happening at the backyard shows. And uh, here I am, finding something funny again. This is a face I used to make when I was a kid. Um, that little weird smile. And Bonesaw, Bonesaw recognizes that, and um, I think he's laughing at me. Uh, let's do a little Sunny series. Here's Sunny, um, just, you know, doing his no shoes thing. There he is again. The monkey feet. You gotta wash them monkey feet, Sonny. Actually, I don't know. They look pretty clean. I'm just trying to find something to say. Uh, anyway, there's Sonny. Um, I'm very jealous of a lot of things about Sonny's looks, and I know I talk about it a lot, but this picture illustrates one of the things I'm jealous about in regards to his hair. I love the way like he's got some strands falling down next to his ears, but most of it's in a ponytail. It's something I've been trying for years. I just can't pull it off, and here he's doing it effortlessly. Uh, some shots of the crowd right here, the Houston crew, and a um, little bit of the Chicago crew, a little bit of the San Fran crew, and a little bit of the Austin crew. Uh, Eric and Missy Stone. Eric, what are you? It looks like you're checking your watch. You don't check your watch. You're Eric Stone. 
time does not affect you. Anyway, moving on. Uh, there's Jax. Jax was feeling it during the backyard show. Um, he was like playing along, like air drumming and stuff. Here he seems to have gotten control of one of the cowbells. Uh oh, smell. Jax has the advantage. Um, and uh, it was just a delight having Jax in the front row. Uh, there's Bonesaw again. He just gets better with age. Such a good-looking dude. Uh, and there's me. Um, you know, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna beat myself up. I'm not a bad-looking dude. Uh, I'm wearing a handsome shirt there. Uh, one of my favorite headbands. I got it going on. I gotta say. Anyway. Um, oh, so this was doing "Send No More Letters," and I don't play any drums during that song. So I thought I would just take the mic off and roam around, sit next to Bonesaw, and just let it rip. Um, I don't get to do that too often, so here I did it. Okay, here we are, big moment. Our friend Mark proposed to his girlfriend, Rachel, at the circus during the backyard show. Here he is getting ready to do it. Here he is getting down on one knee, and she looks thrilled. We're all pumped. It was really a trip to watch that. Uh, you can see Bonesaw, me, Smell, Sean, we're all happy for them. Let's see, there's Rachel is planning a big one on Mark. She's very excited. This is another angle. Gosh, what a day for them. More kisses. Let's see if we can check out that rock. Let's, is there? Nah, looks like we can't quite can't quite get a visual on it. Anyway, there's Rachel. There we see the rock. She's uh, showing it off as well she should. Uh, that was a great moment. We were very happy for you guys. Okay, here I am uh, glancing askance at smell. I wonder what I'm doing. I think I am making sure that he's going to nail the part he's about to play. Smell had a lot of parts to learn for this show because we were doing Roaming Dragons. We don't usually play all of Roaming Dragons, so we had to learn a lot of these weird parts on Glockenspiel, Melodica, etc. But you know what? Here he is saying, F you, Hogue. I got this under control. Go back to your own situation. And uh, you're right, Smell. Well done. All right. The time came for chickens. And per tradition, the host of the venue where we're playing has to do a chicken dance. The host in this case was Colleen, Bonesaw's fiance. So here Colleen gets up, she's strutting her stuff, shaking that tail feather, and Smell is loving it. He's got two hands in the air, and uh, it was a great moment. Um, moving on, uh, I did want to take a moment. Here we have a rare photo of James. James is not in a lot of photos because he takes a lot of photos. I'd say he took well over half, probably well over 65% of the photos of all these slideshows. So there he is. Thank you very much, James. We appreciate all you do for the band. Over to Wahoo's for a little afternoon uh, taco beer extravaganza. Here is some yummy food, and what a great shot this is. Hot sauce. I am hot sauce man. Nicely done. Here's Ryan and Erica. Ryan, you always gotta be making a funny face. What's the deal, man? Just kidding, I love it. Uh, Lauren with Vitali. Canadian Vitali. Otherwise known as Vitale. <laughs> I love that. All right. Some of the Houston crew, Brian and Selena and friends, waiting on their food. Cheeto, Aaliyah, and their friend, who has a name, and I can't remember. I've been introduced to her several times. I'm so sorry. Damn it. Bonesaw! What's Cheeto's friend's name? Jill. It's Jill. There's Jill. Okay, um, anyway, I love it when children are having fun with Vitaly. This is just adorable, and these two are adorable. Um, and as far as this photo, I think I know what's going on here. That's Ryan and Steph, and I think Steph is like, dun, 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 dun. I think they are remarking upon the Megadeth cover we did the night before, Holy Wars, The Punishment Due. Um, what a great table. What a great table. A nice fiesta. All right, here is John and Ryan. Sweet shirts. I just like those shirts, they're sharp. Uh, later that night, we did another show in the backyard. Uh, I'm not gonna do any more photos of us, but here's Bruce Three in the Revenge, AKA Bruce Carilla and TJ. And uh, later that night, we went to Flamingo Cantina to do our side projects. Bonesaw and I did Beat Cake. Here he is ripping a guitar solo. There I am dancing around in the Vitali hat that Lars and Lars's mother made for me and gave to me. There I am rapping with Vitaly. Actually, I'm not rapping with Vitaly. Vitaly is rapping. He's alive. Bonesaw's shoes glowed in the dark, by the way. Thought I'd mention that. Afterwards, backstage, I, um, well, you know, sometimes when no one's around, I talk to my puppet. Um, okay, let me explain this. This is uh, Evan Stern's gear. 
Uh, he wore this to the Beefcake Show, and he was our unofficial hype man. But it's official now, Evan. You're our hype man. Smell and the Other Senses made an appearance. They did a long reggae set. Um, a lot of people sat in and jammed. You can see Bruce is up there. Uh, he was up there most of the time, actually. Actually, I got up there a lot of the time. And um, McGuire made this little graphic. He was enjoying the Smell and the Other Senses set. It was a great Saturday. There's one more episode to go, you guys. Episode four will focus on the show at the Buzz Mill and the puppet show and, uh, you know, our last, our last day at the circus. So stay tuned, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this one. Peace.